FP series tutorial, startup test, flying, spraying, and spreading, flight test. Place the drone on the plane surface and check the status of all the components. After remote controller is booted up, connected to the drone will be shown on the app. Click Start Operation. Check the battery level first. Then click Setting to check the status. Make sure the level sensor and flow meter is activated. Make sure the network is connected and in good status. The magnetic compass, IMU and RC have been calibrated before dispatching. You only need to calibrate them when something goes wrong. I will show you how to calibrate them if needed. Click Remote Controller. Choose the stick mode from the drop list. Take mode 2 as an example. Click Start Calibration. Please follow the tips shown on the app. Keep the control stick in the neutral position and click Next. Push the control stick to the maximum. Then test the buttons on the RC. Press the buttons one by one and make sure the buttons can be used. Click Finish Calibration. Back to Flight Setting. Click on IMU. Click Start Calibration. Pull the throttle stick down to the lowest position. Click OK. Keep the throttle stick to the lowest position during the calibration. Click Completed. Back to Flight Setting. Click on Magnetic Compass. Click Start Calibration. Please follow the tips on the app. Rotate the drone horizontally, clockwise, for calibration. Lift one side of the drone more than 45 degrees. Keep the drone lifted and rotate it slowly, clockwise. Click Completed. Set Hover as Breakpoint Action. Set Hover as Operation Complete Action. Click on Protection Setting. Level 1 Protection Setting. Set 30% battery remaining level as the threshold. Set protection action as alarming. Level 2 protection setting. Set 10% battery remaining level as the threshold. Set protection action as landing. Set return to home as remote control disconnection protection action. Flight parameter setting is completed. Unlock the drone by port two control sticks to the bottom right corner. Release the control stick after the drone start up. After the light green is solid on, push the throttle stick up slowly. Operate the flight direction, altitude, and speed by control sticks. Flight test is completed. Spraying test. Fill the tank. In this test, we use water instead of agrochemical. Press the spray button. If the nozzle does not work properly, loosen the pressure relief valve, one front and one rear. Then start spraying. After the spraying turn to normal, tighten the pressure relief valves. Click the setting icon. Set the spring test parameters to the maximum. Click start. Check whether the real-time flow rate is close to the set parameters. Spraying test is completed. Spreading system test. The drone must be powered off. Replace the tank to granular spreading system. Please refer to the spreading system replace and calibration tutorial. Put the battery on after the replacement is completed. Click the setting icon. Select the operating mode as air jet spreading system. Click OK. Rolling feeder test whether it can roll properly. Adjust the fan speed. Set the rolling speed parameter. Click Start for the spreading test. Make sure the rolling feeder is working properly. Check whether the actual rotating speed is the same as the set value. Check the operating status of the fan and the airspeed will change with the parameter adjustment. Stop the spreading test. The spreading system test is completed. Drone test is completed. Your drone is ready for operation now.